This is Summer. She was born on May 12th, 1999, so she's a Taurus. According to astrology and Google, this means she's a gentle person, but does not like to be pushed around or told what to do. She is kind, but can also be very fiery. She is very independent and values her alone time. She's determined, but can also be very lazy. She has a good eye for aesthetics. She's creative, well-kept, resilient, chill, sometimes overindulgent, is all about music, food, has a good sense of humor, and uses common sense and logic over everything. I mean, Basically, that's it. So let's watch as she goes about her regular day and observe a Taurus being a Taurus. Also, quick disclaimer, first of all, I'm not an astrology expert. I'm just learning about myself and thought this would be fun. Take it with a grain of salt. Let me know if you relate to it if you're also a Taurus. Also, can I just say it feels a bit narcissistic making this video all about myself. Kind of weird, but it's all in good fun. Enjoy. Ah yes, starting the morning off so nicely, sleeping over all of her alarms, causing her to miss her Orange Theory workout class that she scheduled the night before. Very good, very good. Classic Taurus, determined to work out, putting in the effort to do so, and then the sleep just ruins it all. But that's not gonna stop her from having a great day because she is resilient. As you can see, she also loves taking care of herself and doing all of the skincare type things, so she will be doing that now. Putting on a workout outfit, probably the first thing she could find in her drawer. She's now making her way down her stairs, filling up her water, and getting ready to bounce back and still work out, even though she missed her workout class. Good job, good job. Hey Google, play my Taurus today. Good morning, Taurus. Squares Mercury and Libra. The moon piques your curiosity about the social realms you're navigating. Confusion about where you belong could make it tempting to lose yourself in others. Understand that any instability you're feeling right now is a sign of growth. It's okay if your life is quiet right now, so long as it's on your terms. Contemplate the work you do and your career. Notice any area you find yourself prioritizing validation over genuine passion. There's work to be done. It's best to stay the course and focus on that dream that brought you here in the first place. What? No, because why was that completely accurate to my life? Contemplate. There's no way I just did that. I am one of the clumsiest people I know, and that's just the truth. I am constantly doing things like that. I guess it like makes life more interesting, but what the heck? Let's listen to that part again. Contemplate the work you do and your career. Listen to this. Notice any area you find yourself prioritizing validation Numbers. over genuine passion. Over There's what it's work for. To be done. It's best to stay the course and focus on that dream that brought you here in the first place. Like what? Why is that exactly pertinent to my life? That is weird. That is very weird. Thank you for the reminder, Miss Taurus today, woman, because I have been struggling with that. So that's weird. That's crazy. Hi. Hi, Squirtle. Oh, little baby Kiki. Yeah. It's interesting up here, huh? Okay. Anyway, I'm kind of hungry, but I don't want to eat too much before my workout, so I'm just gonna have a little snack. I slept for 24 hours. I mean, <laughs> whoa. I slept for almost 12 hours, which is something I'm not proud of. I want to go for a run outside because I want to get outside, and I'm mad that I missed my Orange Theory class. That is so upsetting. Um, Alexa told me that it was 63 degrees outside, but I just walked outside and it is very warm. So I will be changing into shorts. Now that I've changed, I will finish my Celsius so that I can have max energy and I'll put on one of my favorite playlists. If you don't follow me on Spotify, you totally should. I really, really love my music and I especially love sharing my music with everyone else. So don't judge me, but EDM is my happy music. And so I will be listening to my Let's Get Ravey playlist. <laughs> anyway. Staying very true to the Taurus traits, she is playing her favorite music. Music means a lot to a Taurus. They are an earth sign, so they connect really well with nature. It makes them really happy. So you'll definitely see a tourist stopping to smell the roses on a run. 
Working out kind of makes everybody happy because it releases endorphins, but especially for a Taurus, they love working on their personal aesthetic and they love to move their body. Tauruses really appreciate the finer things in life and love to explore the nicest anything. So this rock wall was very exciting for her. But look how cool it is. I just realized my outfit makes me look like a 14 year old. Anyways, I just ran like two and a half miles and then I went to the gym and did some weighted squats and lunges and deadlifts. I will also be drinking a protein shake. Delectable. As usual, music is playing and she is now indulging in one of her favorite things to indulge in. Taurus people in particular love food. They appreciate food, love to eat it, love to make it. It's just a good time. She's she's feeling great right now. I can guarantee that. Writing is actually a really great thing for a Taurus. It's something that they get to do by themselves. They're very independent people. They're also creative and they enjoy putting pen to paper, getting out their thoughts, letting their creativity flow, and having the freedom to write whatever they want to write. Now it's time to shower, which is something Taurus people either are really excited to do because it's a very relaxing thing you can do alone or they're too lazy to shower. In this case, she was very excited to shower. Shower. She took a pretty long shower as Tauruses tend to get lost and lose track of time and she continued to get ready for the day using all of the many skincare and self-care items she possibly could because life is meant to be enjoyed, right? Now she'll go to her closet to pick out a nice outfit. Tauruses do have an eye for good aesthetics, so she appreciates a stylish outfit. But Tauruses also like to save money. Am I right? Yeah. Yeah, that's what I thought. Well, I found an amazing website called ThreadUp, and I've got some really cute Y2K-inspired outfits for you to try on. Let's go. By the way, thank you so much, ThreadUp, for sponsoring this video. I really, truly love ThreadUp because, yeah, I do like to save money and I like to be on trend. ThreadUp is an online consignment and thrift store, which is really fun. It's very easy to use. So many Y2K pieces. They actually have a whole section dedicated to it. These aren't remakes. These are the real thing. And you can buy things on the website up to 90% off original estimated price. And they've got really great brands to choose from, so you can also shop by brand if you feel like it. There's over 40,000 brands on the website. And on top of all of that, you can feel good knowing that you're shopping in the most sustainable way and you're helping eliminate the amount of clothes we waste every year. Obviously, whether you're a Taurus or not, you're gonna love shopping on this website. I've been using this website for so long. I mean, look at these prices. Look at the price difference. Like, how could you not? Plus, I have a coupon code, yep. If you use code SUMMER, you can get 30% off your first purchase. Highly recommend, 10 out of 10. Thank you so much to ThreadUp for sponsoring this video. You guys definitely check the link in the description box. Since I'm just gonna be at home for a little bit, I'm gonna wear this because this long sleeve is so comfy, such amazing quality, and I threw on this little skirt that I've had forever because it's comfy and pretty cute, and I accessorized, and I'm gonna do some work. Hey, I see you're still working. I am. You have been by yourself all day. Do you want to see anyone? Uh, not really, to be honest. Oh my gosh. Really? I like to be by myself. I'm very independent. Into I know. You like nature, right? Yeah. Well, I heard some people were going hiking. Do you want to join? Uh, that sounds fun. Yeah, it does. But I would have to get ready and be social. Yeah, as a normal person does. I could just stay in and edit. Girl, you always do that. I know. Just go. It'll be fun. Okay, fine. Let me do this and then I will go make food and I will leave. Are you happy? Yes, I'm very proud. Good. I tried my best. I don't know if that bit worked. I would say it kind of did. Yes, I have successfully left the house. So the paparazzi video. won't stop following us. It's literally so annoying. <laughs> What's the 
Flash doing? <laughs> I don't know. Just... What's up? Okay, so I'm here with my favorite Taras. Hey guys. And I'm just finally getting into remembering that I'm a Pisces. So he's a Pisces, which is not a Taurus. So what are some things about me that you've learned in the time that you've known me? Have you picked up on anything? You're fully being put on the spot right now and I expect okay. you to perform really well. Give me two things. No, 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 no. I got, I got this. Okay. I just need to like... Oh, hold that thought. Let it stir. Zoli's here. Yo, I like the color of your car. It's like, it's like different. Right? Thank yeah. you. I appreciate that. I like the color of your sweatshirt. He likes the color of my car. Yeah, I do too. Thank you. Good, good seeing you. So. So we're back. I think if I was to make an observation is that you are a very free spirit. Like you like to feel like you've experienced a lot of aspects of life. Oh, yeah. You love your friends, you love your family, obviously. And you want to be perceived in a way that speaks to them that you love them, which is sometimes being the person that you think that they want you to be. Yeah, this is a way better answer than I is expected. This, is this too much? No, this is really good. Okay, I think you feel a lot. Yeah, I think that was good. It was all, it was all like nice stuff in my head. Yeah, and it was honest and real. And that's all we can ask for. So now I will enjoy my very late dinner. I'm gonna watch some Netflix. That sounds amazing. Bon appetit. I will now be finishing my nights how I always do. Washing my face, brushing my teeth, and then laying in bed for way too long on TikTok. But we do try to avoid it. Uh, no you don't. Yes we do. Okay, maybe not so much because we like it. Overindulgent. Anyway, and I did schedule another Orange Theory class for tomorrow morning that I will wake up for. Thank you. Now I will be flossing. I have just finished my skincare routine, which I totally forgot to film because is that how Tauruses are sometimes? Do they, do they forget things? Do they go into their own world? Uh, yes. Yeah, we're gonna use that. We're gonna use that to justify it. I'm so tired. Let's go to bed. Hi, Katie. Hey, thanks for watching. Comment your astrological sign. I'm very curious. And if you're a Taurus and related to any of this, I want to know. Check out ThreadUp. Link in the description box. You can get 30% off your first order. Thank you again, ThreadUp, to sponsoring this video. This was a really fun video. Um, let me know if you want more astrology-related videos. Never thought I'd say that. I'll see you next week. Good night.